Michael Bever's brother Robert took the stand in his in Michael Bever's murder trial today. Robert Bever is already serving multiple life sentences without parole for killing his parents and three siblings. Well, now a jury will decide if Michael is also guilty of those crimes. News on 6's Taylor Newcomb is live on the story with today's testimony. Taylor. Craig and Lori, there was a powerful moment in court today when Robert Bever broke down saying, I'm sorry, and I don't know what I was thinking. Robert was on the stand all day long today testifying in his brother Michael's defense. Robert said, looking back, it's unfortunate this plan ever came to fruition. He says, for a long time, the plan wasn't real. It was just something he thought about to make himself feel better. Robert went through the entire chain of events of that night in detail. This was back in July of 2015. He talked about how it started, how it ended, taking responsibility for every death and saying he doesn't even remember seeing Michael holding a knife. Robert admitted Michael helped trick the three little ones into unlocking the doors they were hiding behind. Robert says ultimately, though, he's the one who killed them along with their two parents. Robert says he kept a journal, and inside that journal, he created a Robert Bever character who was cold-blooded and ruthless, saying that night he flipped the switch into this character so he wouldn't think about what he was doing too much. Now the question for prosecutors is to find out whether Robert's account of events in court today is true or not. We weren't really sure what we were going to get, uh, but uh, after meeting with Robert, I knew that he would be uh, authentic with the truth, whatever that is to him. And I think that's what we were seeing in there. I think anybody sitting in the gallery would say it's just it's it's hard to even fathom what's coming out of that person's mouth, and and so um, you know what we do is just do our job and and start challenging whether there's truth to what he's saying or not. Robert talked about wanting to be famous. He brought up the Columbine shootings and the Aurora movie theater shooting, saying that he had hoped at that time to create an even larger body count than that. And Robert is not done yet. He'll be back on the stand with more to say on Monday. Reporting live on the scene on the story at the Tulsa County Courthouse, Taylor Newcomb, News on 6.